Ubuntu Studio 25.04 and Ubuntu Mat 25.04. Both arrive under the Ubuntu 25.04 Lucky Puffin bearer, but catered to distinct user needs. Ubuntu Studio 25.04 Lucky Puffin is a multimedia-focused distribution, delivering KDE Plasma 6.3.3 and a rich suite of audio, video, graphics, and photography applications such as Audacity, Order, and KDN Live, all upgraded to their latest versions to support content creators out of the box. Ubuntu Mat 25.04 Plucky Puffin marks the 10th anniversary of the Ubuntu Mat flavor, built around the lightweight Mat desktop on Linux kernel 6.14, introducing optional full disk encryption, enhanced partitioning, and key application upgrades like Firefox 137, Evolution 3.56, and LibreOffice 25.2.2 to deliver a stable and traditional desktop environment. Let's first talk about the introduction. Both distributions share the Ubuntu 25.04 core, codenamed Plucky Puffin, and benefits from the same 9-month support lifecycle. Ubuntu Studio tailors the experience to multimedia production workflows whereas Ubuntu Mat focuses on delivering a familiar desktop paradigm for general-purpose computing. Now let's talk about the desktop environments. KDE Plasma 6.3.3 is the default desktop environment in Ubuntu Studio 25.04, offering modern VLAN support, dynamic panel icons, and deep integration with Plasma tools. Ubuntu Mat 25.04 continues to use the MAT desktop environment built on GTQ. Focusing on ease of use and a classical desktop metaphor appreciated by users who value stability and simplicity. Now, target audience and use cases. Ubuntu Studio is optimized for creators in audio production, graphic design, photography, and video editing with pre-installed applications like Audacity, Order, GIMP, and Blender to facilitate professional-grade workflows out of the box. Ubuntu Mat targets users seeking a stable and initiative desktop for everyday tasks such as web browsing, office productivity, and email, leveraging Firefox, Evolution, LibreOffice to cover all core use cases. Now let's talk about the installation and out-of-the-box features. Ubuntu Studios Installer follows the Kubuntu Calamaris framework with multimedia-centric customizations and restores dynamic panel icons based on installed applications for immediate workflow awareness. Ubuntu Mat 25.04 introduces optional full disk encryption in the installer, enhanced advanced partitioning options, and improved interaction with BitLocker-enabled Windows installation to streamline secure dual boot setups. Now let's talk about the pre-installed applications. Ubuntu Studio 25.04 updates its multimedia suite with Pipefire 1.2.7, Audacity 3.7.3, Ador 8.12.0, GIMP 3.0.0, Krita 5.2.9, Darktable 5.0.1, Blender 4.3.2 and Kden Live 24.12.3 for professional grade content creation right out of the box. Ubuntu Mat 25.04 ships with the major updates to Firefox 137, Evolution 3.56, and LibreOffice 25.2.2, ensuring a robust productivity stack for day to day computing needs. Now let's talk about the system components and tools. Both distributions run on the Linux kernel 6.14, which introduces the new SCADXT scheduling system and NTSync driver to improve performance for containerized workloads and Windows compatibility layers. Ubuntu Studio employs Power Profiles daemon and CPU Power GUI for power management tailored to multimedia production explicitly discouraging the installation of TLP to avoid conflicts with the default power framework. 
Now let's talk about the upgrade and support lifespan. Ubuntu 25.04 flavors, including Ubuntu Studio and Ubuntu Matte, are supported for 9 months with end of life in January 2026. Upgrades from the previous 24.10 release are enabled shortly after release. With Ubuntu Matte using standard Ubuntu upgrade process and Ubuntu Studio providing in-system notifications via the Plasma Distro Release Notifier package. Now finally, the conclusion. In summary, Ubuntu Studio 25.04 is the ideal choice for multimedia professionals and enthusiasts seeking a ready-made content creation environment, whereas Ubuntu Matte 25.04 offers a lightweight, stable, and a customizable desktop tailored to general purpose use. That's it for the video. Thanks for watching. Peace out.